Well, we managed to get old Twinkie in my lap. He's such a big softy. Yeah, he is. Yeah. Yeah, it smells like somebody's been fed some fish and they didn't eat it all. All I can smell is old fish over here. Aw, <laughs> soft, soft. I think he wugged his tail a couple times. <laughs> now, soft, soft wants me to let him down. So, why? Here we go, Twinkster. There's my beautiful angel. He had been holding him for a little bit. Now it's time for him to stretch it all out. Now he loves his gaggle. And I'll bet he's running right back to the gaggle. Now he hasn't been seeing me as much because I skipped last week. I didn't come at all last week. I came and visited him the week before. And the week before that, I don't think I made it either. I can't remember if I did, but uh, my visits have been... I've been skipping visits trying to work a new job and stuff. And the second I got a chance, I made an appointment to visit Twinkie. But before he runs in that water, I'm giving him a hug and a kiss. Yeah, he's trying to get away. He's trying to get out of it. You're not getting out of this, Twinkie. You're not getting out of this, Twinkie. No, 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 no. See, this is our hugs and our kisses. Goodbye, Twinkie. Yeah. I really appreciate you for being my goose. The bestest and the softest. Oh, ho. I almost backed over one of these guys. Yeah, see, they're like right there. She's not worried about me. Not worried about me at all. Yeah, little Summer. She just don't want to let me pet her. I haven't pet her in a long time, but if you've seen all my videos, you know I caught her a few times and pet her. Yeah, so I'm really happy to see. Look at that lettuce, man. Since I put it in there, they gobbled it up. Earlier, in my other video I made earlier, I was just saying how I'm not sure if these birds are really that interested, but as soon as I uh, gave them a little space, they came in here and they devoured the lettuce. That's some kale. It looks like the kale is what's left, but I'm pretty sure by the end of the day that's going to be evaporated. There's Perky. There's old Nelly. Yeah, well, it's our gaggle at this point. Get the new baby. We got about five Canada geese. We've got about four domesticated geese on here, on this property. Now when Easter came here, he was the little outcast and he just wanted me to take him home. Now that he's been here a while, he's part of the gaggle. Um, and he doesn't really like me to um, handle him as much and he really doesn't like me to take him anywhere. So I might take him to the beach this year, at least once and see how it goes, but I noticed in the past if I take Easter to the beach and take him swimming, the other geese um, get really upset about that. And then when I bring him back, there's a super huge rejoice, like, oh, you came back. So um, these geese are all emotionally attached to each other now. And isn't that, isn't that nice? Isn't that just so sweet and so darling? You know, so <laughs> it's my Twinkie. I love him like my own little baby. And he's just a, he's just a goose. Why in, the, why in the heck would anyone care about a goose so much? I guess I'm just a strange duck. And that's why I like to have a super-sized ducky deluxe as my pet, as my friend. You know, the people are getting cats and dogs. You know, people go to the pond with their dog. They go to the lake with their dog. I go to the lake with my goose. You betcha. Because he's the biggest and the softest. Mmm. See? He loves me. He just doesn't want me to mess up his brand new plumage, right? Soft, soft. None of these other geese would let me do that to them. See here? These guys ain't gonna let me pet them. Hmm? Easter, yeah. It's like, he'll let me pet them, but he's just like, eh. Try not to do that too much, please. I've got new plumage I'm trying to pattern in. Yeah, he's trying to get some new plumage. I'm trying to ruffle it all. Nah, I don't ruffle his plumage, but you know. Anyways, that's my Twinkie. That's his little girlfriends. Ah, I love these guys. I'm really glad I um brought him here. 
So now we got all these new friends. Yeah, see now I know Summer and all these other geese and I love them too. Beautiful angel. He's, he's getting his flap on, but I can tell he's just a little bit uncomfortable when they're growing their feathers and that's kind of an uncomfortable thing to do. But little Easter's feathers are coming in really good and then he's got the whole rest of his body. Some of his tail feathers are coming in, but the whole rest of his body Especially his underbelly. I'm sure that itches and it tickles like crazy. So anyways, this will be my final shot. Unless something really neat happens, this should be my final shot and my final farewells. And I hope everyone enjoyed the few videos I'm posting today. So thank you for watching if you do and have a good day.